Hi, I'm author Jeff Summers, and this is Writing Without Rules, where I'm writing a novel called Rough Beast in real time in order to demonstrate some of the lessons I've learned over the course of my writing career. Um, this week, we're still in the doldrums that we discussed last week. I've only progressed to chapter 11, which, which is totally fine. Writing a novel is a marathon, not a sprint. And both those things involve running, and they're both terrible, and, and nothing matters. Wait, 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 wait. Obviously, some things matter, like writing this novel, for example. So I'm still in the doldrums. That's okay. I'm making progress, just very slowly, for no discernible reason. Um, but something exciting happened this week. The stranger showed up. Yikes, that sounds kind of creepy. Who's the stranger? Well, as a writer, have you ever felt like you're not really doing anything except moving your fingers? Um, like you're not actually in charge of your own story or just a vessel for putting words down? I do, pretty frequently. Um, I often go back and read things I wrote a couple of years ago, and I have zero memory of actually writing them. Um, you might say, but Jeff, you have a debilitating love for spirits that's been well documented, and that explains your lack of memories, which is hurtful. The Stranger is the moment in some, not all, but some novels when I wake up and have a wholly unexpected inspiration for a scene, a new plot direction, or other new element that wasn't part of my hazy planning for the book in the beginning. In Rough Beast, I woke up the other day with a new scene in my head that will have a domino effect on the rest of the plot, but it's going to be super fun to write, so I'm all in. I have this weird sense, though, that I didn't do anything. The stranger came and gave me this idea. All I'm doing is keyboarding. It's pretty common for me to feel this way. Eventually, in a few years, I'll crack open this manuscript of Rough Beast, and I'll have absolutely zero memory of having written a word of it. All you can do is roll with something like that um, and hope the stranger is kind to you. Wow, that sounds really creepy. Well, thanks for watching. Until next time, I'm Jeff Summers, and yes, I've considered the possibility that somebody's hiding in my house, sneaking out at night, and writing my novels for me.